It is time for some hardcore Terraria. Well, a lot's happened since last time I played. In between, um, in between pods, I want—I was going to say streams. I lost my train of thought already. Uh, but you know, I've been training to fight the Empress, and I tried two ways. So one of them is um, a defensive way where I was trying the Hallowed set and using dodge. The nighttime fight was fine. Daytime, I couldn't do it reliably. And then um, I saw a video a while back because I did look up Empress a while ago. Um, dude called Terra Steel had a video where it was like a method where you're fighting her aggressively with damage only and you just take her out before she takes you out and so i tried that and had success and you know i trained to the point where i could beat her reliably um i made it so if i could beat her five times in a row without messing up without stress then i would attempt it here and i have done that so <laughs> here we are um, I'm gonna try it. So, but first, um, you know, the, we're gonna get the kaleidoscope, so that might be a process. And, you know, the good thing is, it's practice, either way. Because, um, yeah, it's effectively the same fight, right? But... I've been I recently finished Hollow Knight and um I did all the Pantheon stuff and the Pantheon has a very similar mentality is like it's better to just go aggressive and beat everything and not be afraid of it and just yeah hit it quick before it can hit you um cuz the more opportunities the enemy has to attack the worse it is for you in the long run. And I think that's all this fight is. Is like, if you can get rid of her quickly, then you don't have to deal with her. And that's that's pretty much it. So, it's cool. Um, it was a very useful video. But again, it's not a cheese. It's just, hey, beat her quickly. It might be easier for you if you, if you got like the right thing. I think what I like about it is that the, uh, what else do I need? Ale. The, the fight for the first few seconds of it is, becomes the same every time. It's just the final five seconds or so of the fight. That's the part that's stressful. Everything else is, is fine. So with that, I can kind of get on board with it. It's just don't mess, don't, just stick the landing. Don't mess up. I did try um, just going straight for the daytime fight, but the problem is the harvest doesn't do enough damage quick enough. It's how do I put it? Um, the difference between this and the kaleidoscope is like... The kaleidoscope, I can get to a point where the final few seconds of the fight are fine. With this, the final few seconds of the fight involve dodging like that sunray attack that she does. And she does it low, so it's... There's a chance you get hit by it. Which... I... Yeah, I'm grinding out the kaleidoscope. However long that takes. Um, what else do I need? I think that's it. That seems to be about right. She probably put them there, yeah. Okay. Now we rest. Um, make sure this is off. We'll see how this goes. 
but it should be, um, should be okay. I hope. I hope this wasn't misplaced, um, confidence. Yeah, it's just one of those fights that you just learn the pattern, and if you do enough damage quick enough, then it's a reliable thing. That's there's not too much variance in it, which yeah, it becomes fine. I may have to do something similar for the Moon Lord, but at least with that, that there's room for error there. This is just like well. I could get away with not doing it, but then I think about the alternative, which is go fight Fishron. And the thing about Fishron, I don't know. Between the two, currently, the confidence is higher in this, would you believe it? I guess Fishron is like, if I feel like I'm going to mess up, I can teleport out and I'm safe. With this, there is no such thing. <laughs> it's just dead. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Tough call. In terms of content, this is probably more entertaining. At least I would hope so. I guess I can't make the VOD too long. If it's too long, it'll be obvious that I've won. But is that a bad thing? I don't know. I'll think about it. I don't want it to be too short either. It's one of those things where if it's a super short VOD, well, that's the end of the playthrough. It ends here. Um, I guess I can make backup, yeah, I do have backup gear, so I could continue with a new character, but I'll cross that bridge if I get to it, I guess. And then that way it's like, well, even if the VOD is short, well, sorry, I can make the VOD longer just by going, alright, I'm not trying that again, <laughs> and just continue. With another character. But ultimately I have failed hardcore, I guess, if I do that. I don't know. Just thinking out loud. I kind of brought that upon myself, but see, if that would have been with the kaleidoscope, she would have died. <laughs> see, this is what I mean, is like, with the kaleidoscope, I would have had more damage, she would have been dead. Would have been a hitless run there. Not the kaleidoscope, so we've got to go again. That was not hitless, I was careless. <laughs> Ooh. Accidentally swapped weapons. Honestly, you do this enough times, man. Again, being careless. I could have been more careful there. Ow. Oh, what did I get? A oh, callus? <laughs> what? I did I get? No, I want the whip. I don't want a callus. Okay, hang on. 
These go into storage. Farm and kaleidoscope might be a little annoying. It's alright, it's more practice. If I am this aggressive with her... The kaleidoscope, it's no problem. Part is the scary bit. We need a better way to deal with it. I think I'm going too low. Still no kaleidoscope. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's pretty much the, the, the last few seconds of the fight. <laughs> Every time. Is the scary part. Okay, that was a little sloppy. Yeah, that was even more sloppy. The ending was better, though. Did I... I don't think I got it. How many times do I have to fight her? I don't, I don't want to fight her that much. I guess random is random, right? little bit of time before it becomes daytime again. Sloppy. Okay, that'll get me killed. I'm not careful. But again, if I do it quick enough, I don't have to worry about that part at all. We've got time for one more.
This part should never happen. If we're talking about like a um a real run. Oh my god. Well I mean that's a vanity item, I guess. I'm gonna have to wait. There's not enough time to fight her again. Ugh, well. <laughs> this has become fun. I gotta go back and re-up on potions. I'm just throwing stuff in random locations at this point. This is why I got a bunch of these butterflies um, in the event that um, it didn't give me stuff right away. Kind of figured it'd be the case. Okay, well, we have to wait. Just wondering if there's anything I can do over here to make this easier. I think the problem I am having currently is that... Let's go back to this build. This is in the way. I guess one improvement I can make whilst I'm here. But then also in the sky, that island. Thinking of things I can destroy. <laughs> it doesn't mean life and death. I'm gonna modify this. We'll see, it'll be good. Especially since I don't really need that top part anymore.
I think it'll make a difference. Gives me something to do in the meantime as well. I'm gonna treat it like a lap. So we're moving this here. The whole thing that converts this to a biome, I'm moving it down. It's not in my flight path. I guess doing the nighttime fight first helps because it identifies any problems I have. And I think the current problem is the fact that I keep colliding with this thing. That should be fixable. And that Sky Island as well has got to go. this out. I'm gonna make it a horizontal one. I don't need to farm more prismatic wings or bird wings or whatever they're called, you know, we'll see. Alright, so I'm taking this out. That way there is no accidents in terms of flying into things. 
particularly at the end. Like, fit for purpose. the biome remains it's fine bit this needs to go Be lazy. Get rid of the, the walls. But the Sky Island itself, it's, it's gone. Sure, it's gone. Probably do this. That's better.
skies are clear. Pop in here real quick. Okay. We're ready to go. Oh shit. Hang on, I forgot the slot build. There we go, that's better. That's why you don't want to fight her so much. This is the test. Fully too far to the side. Yeah, not great. for a minute. We got it. Well, no time like the present, I guess. I could do one more, like, just test run. Ah! Why? It wouldn't hurt. with these rolls. Holy crap, dude. Thank you. Okay. It doesn't hurt to do this again. At least... I don't think so. Um, so let's roll with this again. How many do I have? I have five. Alright. Well, that's fine. Alright, let's see how quick this is. Do it again. Let's practice.
Oh, that was bad. Call. That's quick enough. Just bad call. I'm do it again. I'm just not used to this arena. I guess I learnt my arena. Not this one. Did not go quick enough. I gotta get rid of this curse. This curse is taking me out. Okay, I got it. That last part worked. Yeah, this cursor. Off you go. Um, hold on. It's probably better. Okay. One more try. So I was like leaving it. I think it's the end part that I'm more concerned about. Man. Well, I'm gonna try it either way. Sense, but I can probably do it. Okay, so healing doesn't matter. Okay, let's get the potions that matter. Okay, so I need. Inferno and Rage. Need Wrath. Don't need Iron Skin. Swiftness, Flames. Summoner. It's these five. What am I missing? There's no rush. Um, I'm gonna get some major food buff. That's the other thing that'll make a difference is just this. Thank <laughs> you. 
Got it. And that's how it's done! <laughs> okay, that should have dissipated by now. Success! Alright, never again. Let it drop. There's my reward. Oh! Feels good. I got a set as well. Okay, we gotta we gotta go claim our reward. No 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 no. We are now back to this and um Where are you? UFO go away. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, they look cool. Very cool. I like the inverted nature of it. It looks really cool. Or if we don't invert it, how does it look? No, they look cool. Inverted blades. I like it. I can't believe I did it. When it really counted, I got into the mindset and did it. When it really, really counted, I did it. Another kaleidoscope. Oh wow, no, they look even cooler. That's sick. I don't think I got the wings. <laughs> so many people died in that fight. Okay, well. Don't need... I'm gonna put that there, it's fine. Um... Well, yeah, now there is... There is no need for the other stuff. Even this gets retired, like a lot of stuff just gets retired at this point. Sanguine staff retired. All right, retired. I kind of want the wings. <laughs> um, that goes here. Hold on. That goes back here. Okay. should feel accomplished, man. Okay. 
yeah, I mean, you do something enough times, you achieve your goal. I'm glad I did this. Okay, um... coming down from that high of, like, beating it. <laughs> There's another death set in here. about something now not to get cocky but like what is this what is this gonna do I'll still buff up like normal to see this in action. Okay. 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 Calm down. That's that. Yeah, this was this was worthwhile. This is certainly worthwhile. I've never had this weapon before for the record, it's like It seemed like one of those things that was unattainable. I was like, eh, that seems like suffering, I'm not gonna bother. Oh, this is as strong as a summoner gets, right? Like, it doesn't get any better than this. <laughs> well, actually, that's not true. There's still the, the summoner gear at the end, but still. every time again because I'm, I'm in the mood I 
know, I just got in really lucky with the trophy drop. Yeah. Alright. That's that, boss. stuff. Okay. It's cool. I guess. Light stuff is neat. Well, now the only thing I want is like Tabby. I guess that's the thing, replace the shield with it. Maybe. But otherwise... Oh, man. It's great. Um, I do want the wings from her. They are good wings. go hunt more lace wings if I want them. It's either that or fight fish run, but like uh, <laughs> it would suck to die to fish run. Um Okay, hang on. I need a battle potion to do this. I mean I guess I should for the sake of completion. Do I really care about completion? Not convinced. Oh, I need the critter thing. Hang on. I need the critter thing. I need the critter thing. Before something terrible happens. Where'd I put it? There. Active. Cool. A good catch. I want them wings.
How many have I got? I got four. And given that I fought her, what, 10, 12 times? I can't remember how many times. And it didn't give the wings, so I should try and get as many as I can. I should say what the best stat for this is. Or at least the recommended one. I guess... What do I got? Yeah, I can fight her like this, I think. Confidence has grown. Why not that? It is now this. Um... so much quicker. I mean, you would hope so. <laughs> yeah, that's amazing timing. Got room for one more. squeeze one and it's like 30 seconds of fight it's ridiculous how quickly you can do it Here, I don't need to worry about being perfect. That pressure's gone. Okay, no more. <laughs> We're good. Go 
one. Did I got the wings. I got another dev set. Another devs. I, I didn't see what I got. I got another dev set. I got the wheel set already. No wings. Another kaleidoscope. I mean, I don't want to be pedantic about getting wings, but at the same time... Um, what's the best? The Terra Prisma. Give me a sec. Ruthless. And so, it would appear I have to get ruthless. Ooh, re-rolling is hard. Expensive. Mythical? Wow, it's like one plat to re-roll it. Ruthless. There it is. Got it. <laughs> we good. Very good. Had that developer set. Where's the wings to the set? They're not, they should come with wings. They're not there. junk around the place. I'm 
I have no idea. Probably collect the tombstones around the place as well. The various NPC ones. Should head over there where the party girl is. I wouldn't call it a cruise towards the end, but you know, this certainly helps a lot. I'm under no illusion as to what is going to happen. Yeah, I mean, that's the guide thing. approaching pillar territory. There's no tombstones here. I mean, I've gotten dev wings, but not wing wings. I guess I'll wait out one more fight. I think I'll I'll keep the VOD to being short, then there's like, oh, potential anticipation. <laughs> but then it's not well revealed just in the time that I I, I beat her. But also let me have a mental reset of not being so tense. <laughs> summoning, I guess. Well, it's glad, glad to see that the training paid off. Isn't the, um, hmm, the princess supposed to show up, or am I wrong? Oh, maybe I need a room free here. Realize, wait, she's not here.
This water's nice wood. I think this is the reason why she hasn't moved in. Maybe. to death. that um the projectiles persist after she dies oh my god still no wings how did i even get anything for that no turn the book back on i don't think i got anything for that what's the oh like the night glow i guess that's what i got All right, like, now that I'm at this stage. I'll gather some for the rest of the night, but, um... Otherwise, we'll leave it. Determined to get these wings. <laughs> Instead of fish run stuff. But I'm probably not gonna do in this VOD. Again, just to keep it short, so then there's anticipation whether or not I did it. Obviously, if I had a longer VOD, it would mean I won.
Five seconds, four seconds, three seconds, two seconds, one second. Alright, let's hit it. What I'll do, I'll make it close to evening the next time it's set. Let's see if she moves in. She will. I forgot about strange plants. Strange plants are used to make make uh yeah, can be traded for rare dice. Man, I forgot about that system. I guess when you're just <laughs> going for gameplay and not builds and making things look nice, um, it's different. Yeah, well. Yeah, I completely forgot that these exist in the world. I might see how to get her as an NPC and the remaining slimes and then achieve that next time. I thought it was just have a house in the... Hello, but I guess not. <sighs> Again, happy. <laughs> Just my efforts. I think definitely the game changer in the attempts. If I didn't remove this, I don't know how this would have gone, ultimately. Um, but yeah, I mean, again, going aggressive worked. But of course, you do have to do the legwork to learn the fight. Like there's, it's not just, hey, get these items and you win. You have to learn the fight. And I think it's easier. Just because, it again, you saw, it's like, you can get the fight to be pretty reliable. In terms of the movements that happen. Provided you attack quick enough. See what he has. Mm, meh. Just yeah, you have to be as aggressive as you can be. Uh, well, I need to think about whether I want to do Fishron, but effectively next time it's Fishron or, or Pillars or both, but you know, we're kind of heading towards the end here. Um, I mean, I don't know if I'm going to trophy hunt. I could do that at the very end, just to round off the VOD, well, not the VOD, the series a bit more, and it's like, hey, look at this, I earned it. These are... This is it. <laughs> I mean, we'll see. Um, anyway, let's wrap this one up here. I usually make them a bit longer, but for the sake of, you know, making it suspenseful, um, you don't know the outcome, I'm gonna wrap this VOD up here. Thank you for watching, sticking around to the end. Hope you did enjoy the Empress of Light fights and the uh, successes we had. Um, yeah, in the meantime, if you want to support the channel, you can do things like click the like button, subscribe, 
or you can watch me play other things as well by clicking any of those videos that pop up. That stuff does help the channel out a lot, so thanks to those that do that and check out some of the other content. Uh, but yeah, we will continue this hardcore playthrough next time. So it's all set for nighttime fights. Alright, see ya and thanks for watching.